In this video, I'm just going to show you how to schedule and progress workouts and programs over the period of that particular program. Inside your client or your group dashboard, just scroll down and click on the programs tab. This brings up a list of all of your programs. Choose the program that you want to schedule. And then inside the action drop down menu, choose scheduling and progressions. To schedule the programs, just choose the workout that you want to schedule. So I've got a Monday, Wednesday and Friday workout. So I'll choose Monday, select the date. So in my case, it will be Monday. So I'm going to go for the next Monday. Select the time if you wish to. If you don't want your clients to have a specific time, then a good idea is just to schedule them to go in the morning so clients get a little reminder that they've got a training session that day and it's in their account ready to use. If you want to repeat it, click on repeating. And for this one, I will do once a week for four weeks. So leave the one, put in weeks, and then select four weeks and add to schedule. You can see that then goes into the schedule for your clients. Now, if you wish to progress that workout over the four weeks, you can do that by clicking on progressions. And that will allow you to make new acute variables for each individual day's workout. So you can change any of the sets, reps, time, tempo, rest and intensity. If you want to change the weight, just put that into intensity, obviously. So I could just go in and change the reps. You can use a tab button to go through or you can just scroll down and do the same thing for each one. You can also use copy and paste if you wish to copy and paste anything into any of the boxes to make it really, really fast. Once you're happy with all your changes for that particular day's workout, you can click on save or if you want to put it into other days, you can click save and copy. Save and copy allows you to choose any of the other days that they're doing that particular workout to copy those changes to. So for example, if you're doing undulating reps, that could be really, really useful to copy to a couple of the workouts and not all of them. So you can just tick or untick the ones you want to do and click on OK, and that will copy those changes to that workout or those workouts as well takes you back into the scheduling. So you've still got Wednesday and Friday. So just select your other workouts, do Wednesday, and I will select the next Wednesday. Once again, I'm going to repeat it for every week for four weeks and add. And then I can do the same thing with Friday, select Friday, change the date obviously to the next Friday and then I will leave the repeating variables the same and add to schedule. You'll notice that all of the workouts are listed here, so they're named, so it's easy to find them. All of the dates are here, all of the times, and you can progress any of the acute variables for any of the workouts in exactly the same way that we did for the Monday workouts. When you're happy with everything, just close it all down. And if we come up to look at next week in the schedule, you'll see that their workouts are there on the correct days. And as you scroll through the weeks, they're there each week for the four weeks. So that's how easy it is to schedule programs and workouts inside PT Distinction for your clients to do on specific days. Now you don't have to schedule the programs. You can just leave them in for clients to pick and choose on any day, which ones they do. You can also schedule programs from inside the program builder. So when inside the program builder, just scroll up to the top and click on schedule program.